hello and welcome to my channel i'm noma kamuna Heng, and if you are new here you're welcome and to my returning subscribers thank you very much and welcome back so today i'm doing a vlog on how we went about shopping for our christmas outfit okay. as well as doing the christmas outfit so come with me Now, uh, last year we had red and white dresses, so I'll probably go for this one. And welcome to my sewing room so I'll just share with you what I bought from the store so this is the first fabric so from this it's a Christmas fabric so from this I'm going to make a table runner as well as napkins for the table because I'm hosting the Christmas lunch and then this are the fabrics for the tutu so I'm gonna see how I'm gonna go about it um the green is definitely gonna be on top and the red is just gonna show at the bottom of the skirt and then i'm gonna add the elastic so i've got this nice beautiful elastic for the skirt it's golden color so that's the one that i'm gonna use on top and then my daughter asked that we add these pom-poms on the skirt so i don't know how it will look like but um this is what the pom-poms look like this is what they look like so we'll just put them um on the skits like that on different places and that's what um the skits will look like for both the girls and then what i also bought um this is the fabric for my dress so I'm going to make a dress um, that is similar to the one that I had during the Ankara week. So this is a dress that I'm going to make. So I'll be making it from this fabric. So I'll decide if the sleeves are going to be different or what. But at the moment, that's the design that I'm going for. And yeah, that is all. I also got um, some cottons. This is a cotton that matches my fabric and that is all that I bought from the fabric store. So let's get into it. Let's sew together. So the height that I'm going for for the skate for the little one is 30 for the red and 25 centimeters for the green. So what's going to happen is that the green is going to be on top and the red is going to go out at the bottom there. So I folded it in two. And... I've changed my mind about the dress that I'm going to do for Christmas. So the one that I'm going to do, um, it's going to be your normal um, bodies on top. And then I'm going to have three tires going down. So with the fabric that I have, I bought four meters of fabric. So if I put it this way, this way going down, this will work perfectly in terms of 
um, creating those long tie-ins for my dress. This is the dress pattern that I have. I'm just gonna cut it to up here. For the three tires, I'm just gonna go measure under my bust up until below my leg or my knees. I got 70, so I will say 72, including the weight 76 actually to include um, the seam allowance to join all of them, and then 76. I'm gonna divide 76 by 3 and that's the room width. Welcome back to my channel. This is the final day for me to finish the dress. So last night I went ahead and searched the, all the ends, like you can see there. So now I just need to put the dress together. Um so I'm done now with the the straight line so that i can shade up so i'm just gonna put it aside for now and then i'm gonna concentrate on my bodies so this is just a normal bodies i also cut some facing with the same fabric because i don't want any fabric to be left behind yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and sew this part and this is the back and then when we are done we're now gonna put in the tires and then when I'm done with that I'm gonna put in the sleeves what you do is that you put your dress on the right side facing up as well as the tire right sides facing each other and then you pin everything down and then when you are done you will sew here at the top for example if we are pinning this down like that you're gonna go and make a straight stitch here and then when you open it up it's gonna be on this side up and then when i'm done with it at that time i'm just gonna go and hem the bottom and these are our outfits for christmas if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you would like me to do more vlogs please do comment down below that you love the sewing vlogs i will definitely make more videos in future where i do not have time to record and um, all the sewing process i will definitely put in the vlog in there and don't forget to subscribe and share until our next video hashtag let's sew with k yeah!